Good morning. This is your Blue Water by Carriott Schools video of the day. This day in history, September 20th, in 1519, Ferdinand Magellan set sail, attempting to circumnavigate the world. Magellan perished, but one of his ships completed the journey in 1522. Today, in 1870, the Papal States were taken over by Italian troops, leading to the unification of Italy. The devil is right at home. In a speech to the UN in 2006, Venezuelan President Hugo Chavez repeatedly referred to President George W. Bush as the devil. And on this day in 1973, the Battle of the Sexes was fought on the court. Champion Bobby Riggs was a male chauvinist who believed that women players were inferior. Billie Jean King proved him wrong and beat him in straight sets. The victory gave a big boost to women's tennis and made King the queen of professional sports. And that's this day in history. This is Franciscan Media's Saint of the Day for September 20th. Today we celebrate Saints Andrew Kim Taigon, Paul Chung Husong, and Companions. Christianity came slowly to Korea, beginning in the late 1500s. 200 years later, a small homegrown church had taken root. The son of Christian converts, Andrew Kim, was born in 1821. Andrew studied for the priesthood in China. When he returned home, he helped missionaries enter the country by a water route that would elude the border patrol. The first native-born Korean priest, he was arrested, tortured, and finally beheaded near Seoul in 1846. His father, Ignatius Kim, had been martyred in 1839. Paul Chung, a married layman, lost several family members to martyrdom. He risked his life, making repeated journeys to China in an effort to find priests who would come to Korea and serve the young church. He was martyred in 1839. When John Paul II visited Korea in 1984, he canonized the two of them, along with 98 other Koreans and three French missionaries who had been martyred between 1839 and 1867. The Pope called them the leaven that led to the splendid flowering of the church in Korea. And for the verse of the day, from the Gospel of Luke, when Elizabeth heard Mary's greeting, the child leaped in her womb, and Elizabeth was filled with the Holy Spirit and exclaimed with a loud cry, Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb. And why has this happened to me, that the mother of my Lord comes to me? For as soon as I heard the sound of your greeting, the child in my womb leaped for joy. And blessed is she who believed that there would be fulfillment of what was spoken to her by the Lord. Bible trivia. Yesterday's question was, who is Goliath? The answer was a giant. Today's question, who killed Goliath? And finally, the joke of the day. What do you get when you throw a lot of books in the ocean? A tidal wave. Everybody have a great day.